Hello. So I want to do a quick unboxing video of my turbo wheel dart. I just got it in the mail. Um, e wheel shipped it via FedEx, and they require signature upon delivery. So you got to make sure you're home on the weekday. Comes in a pretty big box. It's 50 pounds. Sorry, this isn't easy to do with one hand. Okay. All right. Looks very well packaged. Lots of styrofoam, I like that. I was pretty worried about it being damaged on shipping. Looks like they did a good job though. It's got some instructions on the top. This looks like, uh, I'm guessing the charger that I bought. I did opt for the quick charger. This side is the trolley wheels. And that looks like a set of Allen wrenches or hex keys, whatever you want to call them. Inside we got the scooter. No easy way to get that out really, so I guess I'll just take that out. Let's see if we can set this up. Hmm. Well, I can't think of any easy way to set the phone down and take this out. Traction pattern. I thought I read everything there was to read about this thing, and I watched a lot of unboxing videos, or the, the two there are why I'm making this but I still can't figure out how to unfold it it's not as heavy as I imagined it would be um, you're supposed to be able to lift that and then unfold the scooter somehow so I need to figure out how to do that but it smells new they didn't ship me a used one I'm happy about that I know it's not Amazon but I've had a lot of problems with people doing that to me so um, I guess I'll do a more in-depth review video once I've ridden it more, but, uh, this is what it looks like new. I'll do like a slow walkthrough so you can see the build quality. This looks like some paint or something on here. Some nice grip tape. Oh, they rewired the uh, 
headlight wire. I was reading that previous versions of the scooter had a headlight wire that was up here, and apparently when you um, compress this front suspension, the headlight wire was getting severed. So it looks like they might have done something to fix that. And they definitely wrapped this wire in some robust, um, looks like sleeve, I'm guessing to prevent uh, weathering. I'm going to try my best to weatherproof this scooter. It looks like it's got a long ways to go. There's really no real waterproofing here. It's kind of a hole into the battery compartment. That must be the rear drum brake. Sorry this video is so uh, long and awkward and weird, I really don't have anything to say. But there aren't a lot of videos of this scooter on the internet, so I'm just kind of taking a video of it so you can see, sort of close up, what it looks like not being driven around at 30 miles an hour, maybe. And I'll do another video of it once I get it all put together and stuff. But I guess that's it for now. It just comes with the uh, trolley kit, two wheels charger, two pages of instructional material, and the tool. And if you opt for the charger, it comes with another charger here too.